Hispanic Lifestyle is pleased to have the support of Wells Fargo Bank. For more information, visit their website at wellsfargo.com. With roughly 60 million Latinos in the U.S., we highlight Latinas of influence, businesses surviving to thrive. We talk culture, travel, health, wellness, music, entertainment, and of course, food. Our passion is to share inspiring stories with the community. I'm Richard Sandoval, and this is Hispanic Lifestyle. I know I intimidate people in my interviewing <laughs> skills. And... I haven't talked to anybody since March. Let's do that. Oh, wow, <laughs> wow. It, but, but what I really want to get into... Wait, count? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Uh, nervous, Richard. All right, we'll I know what I what I really want to get into is the concept of the company. You mentioned subscriptions earlier. Is this something I subscribe to and I, I get this package and I might be surprised at what I get every month? My Cajita is a subscription box service company. We feature artisans every month. All of our members get a different box, a surprise that comes to them every month. We have everything from glassware, we have home decor, fashion, um, and things you can use for if you're serving dinners, for your family, for your friends, all artisan made. Um, once in a while, we feature brands as well in our boxes as a surprise. Um, so yeah, I mean, that's pretty much what we do every month. And you can see we have some of the products here that we can speak to in a few minutes about um, our October box where we're featuring Day of the Dead products. Are you guys comfortable with sharing the pricing on the subscription? Yeah. Uh, Richard, uh, the great thing about the subscription box is that you can get these as low as $45 a month with shipping included. Uh, one of the challenges that we have as a business and one of the reasons why I spend a lot of time in Mexico is we work directly with the artisans. We cut a lot of the middlemen out. And by working directly with the artisans, we ensure that the bulk of the money goes back to the artists and we're able to get these products at a very good price and get them into the United States and ship them out. And all of that just comes down to logistics and being organized, which is um, kind of under my wheelhouse as the chief operating officer. But for $45 a month, you can get this Dia de los Muertos box experience at home with shipping included. We also sell ancillary products. We do have an online store where we sell some of these more uh, extravagant pieces like these big Katrina pieces that you see here that don't necessarily always fall within the Dia de los Muertos box. Uh, mm -hmm. as well as this jumbo skull if you can see it right here this thing is gorgeous it's all hand painted by a Nahuatl artist who's from Guerrero and so these are the kind of unique experiences that we bring here it's Mexico delivered to you um, yeah and we think it's a great deal I, I just want to be clear I get a box and all those items in the background are coming in that box well, no then Richard Okay. The, what you get for the Dia de los Muertos experience is the, it's called Ofrenda, it's all the altar pieces. So you would get three, three separate altar pieces. Each one has a purpose. Um, a velero, which is for candles. A copalero, which is to burn copal, which is like a tree resin. And a salero, which is to hold salt. Uh, and then you get this hand carved Frida skull. And then you get one string of papel picado, which is this uh, cut up uh, paper mache in the background. And then you also get um, four Simpasuchi scented candles. You get a bag of charcoal, ready to light. You get a bag of copal, which is a tree resin. And then you get a bag of salt. And so with all these elements, that's how you ex experience and celebrate a traditional Dia de los Muertos experience. Are people able to order individual pieces as well? Mm -hmm. uh, some of the items that I see on the altar now? Yes, definitely. Uh, we have an online store where a lot of these items are also available a la carte. And if they don't fit within the $45 subscription box price point, um, they're also, you're also able to buy them. Um, normally every monthly experience, we try to add ancillary products that they can add at a minimal additional cost uh, with no additional shipping cost to their monthly subscription. Uh, but in, for this case, for the other Los Muertos, some of the ancillary products, like I said, are this like jumbo skull, a little hand painted skull over there, these taller Katrina dolls, this, this guy over here. So these are ancillary products that you can purchase a la carte as well. Even uh, and that's the other thing is, even down sorry to interrupt you, Rachel. Um, the subscription box is available without a subscription as well. It's at a higher price point. So that's why the value is for, for people to join on and get the subscriber's price. I know you bring the items 
the items are provided in the subscription box, but do you also uh, provide some, maybe some instructions? Maybe this is the first time you're building an altar? Well, yes, actually Danny put together how to build um, your own altar, which is going to be live on the website as well. Um, so yes, and we also have an online magazine, so you can go on there, you can learn more about the artisans, you can learn how to use the products in your home, including the Day of the Dead box as well. So that'll all be included. One of the things I love talking about is surviving to thrive. Uh, I know you guys have been in business for a few years now, but with this pandemic and everything going online and uh, Hispanic lifestyle, we produce events where people come and gathered. Now we are taking our content online. Um, I really kind of feel like when I was introduced to your company, that the marketplace is in fact coming to you. So I don't know who uh, is best to answer this question, but is that, a, is that how it seems to you? The business is now, the marketplace is now coming to your company? Um, we definitely noticed that, that there was an uptick. I mean, with everyone having to stay at home right now and our company, our mission is to create experiences at home. Um, I think it was a, a great time for the company because especially with our glassware and we have Talavera dishes and things that can create beautiful experiences with your family for dinner. Um, if you're in a, in a partnership, you know, we can celebrate with a cocktail. And I think um, our company has been able to provide those experiences for people. I mean, we're, we're at home and it's like, this is a time for us to be creative and creating memories with our loved ones. Talk about bringing a whole new experience into the household, even if you're not Latino. You know, Richard, I would say this is a great opportunity. We've been given a gift with this coronavirus and having to cancel what is traditionally our Halloween, which is getting dressed up, going door to door and getting candy. Uh, we have this really great opportunity to really kind of pick up the other Los Muertos, Day of the Dead, and, and learn about it and celebrate it. Because one of the things that makes this very unique and makes it very unique to the Mexican culture is that we celebrate death. We don't mourn the death of someone. We celebrate their life. And that's what right. this is. This is an altar to celebrate the life of your loved one, right? So think about how much your child may know about their grandparents or their great-grandparents. And this is an opportunity for you to teach them, to teach them about what was grandpa's favorite drink or what was his favorite food or what interests and things that they had. Because part of your friend at the table usually incorporates those things that they really, really enjoy. Whether for my grandfather, a deck of playing cards, and he was a big Paloma fan, which is tequila and squirt. So my friend always has tequila and squirt, uh, you know, to celebrate him and, and, and for him to come to, to enjoy this experience with us. So I, I think that's um, something that's very unique and, and a gift that we can have to really preserve the traditions that we have and create new traditions with the next generation in front of us. Even if you're not Latino, the idea of celebrating the life of your, de your deceased uh, grandfather or your parents or your, your mother uh, and sharing that with the next generation, I think it's just, it's an awesome gift and one we should not miss out on. I really wanna commend you to for Embracing the moment, you referred to it, Danny. I feel the same way, is that there are some opportunities and there's choices that we can make in life. And what do they say? Make uh, lemonade out of lemons. And, and you two are definitely doing this. So I, I want to thank you again for your time this afternoon. And um, I'm going to give you guys the last words. Rachel, you first. Well, thank you for having us and for, for giving us this opportunity to share more about my cajita and what we're doing. And um, we are very excited that we do get to be a part of everyone's experience at home and that our members are happy and feel great with what we've been providing with them monthly. Um, this is a time where we can use this opportunity, as Danny said, to celebrate, to create experiences, to create memories with our families and our loved ones at this time. Um, and I just am really happy to be part of this team and my cajita and that we get to create this for people. Um, that element of surprise is so much fun when you're part of a subscription box service. It's something to look forward to every month, getting something special that's just for you and that's artisan made so every piece um, they have something a little different about them which makes it very special so I'm just really happy to be part of this team and I'm happy that we can create experiences and, and bring joy to people's households. That was beautifully said Rachel. Uh, I, if I could just add that one of the, the things that I really enjoy about what we do 
is that we work directly with the artisans. Uh, you know, this, none of this is manufactured in a factory. These are all handmade, hand-painted, handcrafted, art, art, artisanal products that in many cases are third, fourth, fifth generations. Uh, and, you know, they're very, very unique things that you just don't find anywhere. Mm -hmm. And you might find something similar, let's, let's say on the border, uh, you might find a, a coffee mug, but I promise you it won't be the same one uh, because Don Jose Pila, who, who does designs ours, hand paints every single one of them. Uh, and so that's that uniqueness, uh, that ability to reconnect with Mexico, with its artesanos, with its culture, uh, and ensuring that every single time you purchase a box, you know a good chunk of that is going right back to the artists and you're supporting those communities. And sometimes they're indigenous communities that work and collaborate together to create textiles like these beautiful fabrics behind us. Uh, and it's just uh, something that, you know, you're spending and investing your money in people and, and not these, you know, faceless corporations. And so there's a feel good behind it as well. So we invite you to check us out at www.mycajita.com. That's M-Y-C-A-J-I-T-A.com. Uh, you can also follow us on Instagram, Facebook, and Pinterest. Uh, and just remember, you can get this delivered to your home, shipping included, for as low as $45 a month. Oh, great. Uh, again, be well, be safe, and uh, congratulations on your venture. And look forward to hearing more from you guys. Awesome. Thank you, Richard. Really appreciate it. Didn't get enough? There's always more at HispanicLifestyle.com. And follow us on your favorite social media platform.